Hey guys, it's Wanda from Deep South Homestead. And today we're going to be talking about popsicles and ice cream. Uh, Harvest Dry sent us a freeze dryer a few months ago and we've been using it here in our humid climate, seeing how things do and if they will stay um, freeze dried and things like that, how long the storage is going to be. But today we're going to be talking about ice cream. I kind of like my ice cream frozen. <laughs> so the deal is I tried ice cream sandwiches and popsicles. The popsicles are from Pops Brothers which is here on the coast of Mississippi and they're special popsicles. Now I went to Jack's Plant and Patio here in our town and bought I think five, one, two, three, four, about six different types of popsicles. I bought the Jolly Rancher, Bark's Root Beer Float, Oreo Cheesecake, Berries and Cream, Very Berry Lemonade, and Strawberry. Um, the first part of my video that I did showing putting all these things into the freeze dryer got lost. So I'm having to recreate just a little bit for you. Um, I laid out all the popsicles and I opened the ends of them and just left them in the plastic bag that they were in. Now, the ice cream sandwiches, I bought the minis. I bought um, just regular ice cream sandwiches and then I bought the Neapolitan. And some of them I cut in half, some of them I left whole, some of them I think I even cut in thirds just to see if it made a difference. Some of them I left in the paper, just opened the paper up, but most of them I took out. I'm going to show you what happened when I took everything out of the freeze dryer, my first explosion in the freeze dryer, and my reaction to what all of it tasted like, how the popsicles did, how the ice cream did. My ice cream is supposed to be done. I've got it turned. I've opened the valve. If I have a mess, I wanted to document this. <laughs> I'm almost scared to see what it looks like. And I got to know, ooh, I do have a mess with one of the popsicles at least. Ooh, ooh, ooh. let's see. It's still cold, so we've got to run some more time. I do have a mess in some of it. Tastes good, but... Okay, that one back there didn't mess up. The ice cream sandwiches seem okay. I think they're done. The little ones seem done. No mess, only with a couple of the popsicles. So I'm going to put this back in because I did taste some cold in it and we're not done yet. All right, I took out the ice cream sandwiches. This is the Neapolitans. I put some in this bag. I'm gonna vacuum seal them down for temporary eating shortly. This is the Dreamsicle. You can see, did nothing happen to it. Looks awesome. I've got the other ice cream sandwiches already in bags, fixing to seal them down, but I wanted to document right quick. I'm doing peppers too. These were the little minis. They did awesome. I don't think we've had a problem with any of them. Some of them I left in the paper whole, and they're still whole. See, the inside, creamy. Y'all, when y'all taste this, it melts in your mouth. But the cookie is an awesome graham cracker cookie. But the ice cream just melts. Now I gotta get these in a sealed bag right quick. All right, so I've gotta get everything done, but this is the inside. That's the outside. Looks like ice cream, but it's not. It's just fluffy. When the ice cream hits your mouth, it just totally goes away. The outside is like a crunchy graham cracker, I guess, chocolate graham cracker. It's good, but y'all like my ice cream frozen. But if you 
grid down situation, you don't have ice cream, this is the next best thing. All right, so we're gonna document Popsicle the strawberry. It looks kind of funky. It came out of the bag at the end here. We're gonna see, taste strawberry. These are done. I'm gonna go put those in a bag, the ice cream sandwiches, but very strawberry tasting. Crystals just melt in your mouth. And this is a Pops Brother here. Now this one, this is the other Popsicles and the blue one is the one that gave us fits, but looks like all the others this one exploded whatever it was this one did good this one just filled the tube and came out so we're gonna look at flavors and see what happened and I got a little bit of blue in there I don't know if I can reach it we're gonna keep the blue and I've got a little bit of a mess in there I can see all right so this is the strawberry this is from props brother strawberry and there's you can see a lot of it's out it just melts in your mouth tastes really strawberry this one i'm not sure what flavor the root beer okay so this is the root beer you can see it came all to pieces Melts in your mouth kind of root berry. This one, the berries and cream stayed together. This one, the Oreo cheesecake stayed together, but you've got the blue exploded on it here. But this one kind of stayed together. So we'll have to take them out of the plastic in a little bit. This one was the Berry Berry Lemonade. It is nothing but a giant popsicle round exploded thing. And the blue did the same thing. It just kind of exploded. It was a Jolly Rancher. So, now this did not freeze. It's, it's a gob, so I'm sure it was candy, looks like. It's part of the Jolly Rancher. This didn't freeze at all. All this did, all this did. All of this one looks like all of these froze, but this one has something in the middle. So the Jolly Rancher, this was probably a piece of Jolly Rancher. If I ran it long enough, it probably would have finally dried. But as it is, it's a sticky mess. Overall, I would not do popsicles especially these popsicles these are specialty popsicles the berries and cream has vanilla blackberries raspberries blueberries lime juice cane sugar salt gargum xanthan gum that's what's in it okay it pretty much seemed to stay together stay the same size because it had some cream in it i'm assuming the cheesecake the Oreo cheesecake did pretty good. It got the blue on it, but it's all together hung in there like that. The root beer just kind of exploded. There's not much of it left. It's mainly on the tray. The strawberry just made a really, it just kind of collapsed. Kind of strange. The very berry lemonade. It probably did the best. It looks like a giant tube. This tube is totally expanded. And the Jolly Rancher did next to the best because it's pretty expanded, but it did shoot the Jolly Rancher piece of candy out the end. But, you know, you can see what it looks like. It just melts in your mouth. It goes away to nothing. A lot like cotton candy. I wouldn't do these again but I would do the ice cream again. The ice cream is okay, but I would not do the ice cream all the time because I'd rather have my ice cream cold. 
All right, so this might be a mess to clean up, but this, when this hits water, just comes right off. I'll pitch these. Here, the Jolly Rancher may be the biggest mess we've got. We're going to see, and then we're going to go check the freeze dryer. Strangely enough, this comes off pretty easy because it's already freeze dried. It just lifts off. It's sticky. But when you put it back in your mouth, it turns right into a Jolly Rancher, just kind of like that blob does. So that's kind of weird. So the Jolly Rancher is real sticky. All right, let's turn the hot water on. And it just melts easily. See? It away. So let's hope and turn it around. Draw the rancher. Let's hope the freeze dryer comes as clean as this because that hot water just takes it right off. Stainless works well. Until this ice freeze uh, melts. We're going to have to just let it sit and then we'll clean it because it's catching right here on the side when I go to pull it out and it won't let it come all the way out. So we're going to, instead of running the defroster right now, we have bad weather coming in. I'm leaving the door open. I've got the drain open back here. We got it where it'll drain in the bucket. We're going to let it dry naturally because of the weather and just sit here. I'm going to turn it off and turn the pump off. Switch on the back, switch on the back of there, and I always turn the pump here off too. That way it is totally off, and we're going to let it thaw out, come back, and clean it up. So guys, I guess ice cream is something I would rather have frozen. It's not, um, it's not that I didn't like it. It is good, I guess, long-term storage if you want to do the ice cream sandwiches. I have several of them in Mylar bags stored up for future use. Um, but it's not something I would freeze dry on a regular basis because it's just, I wouldn't need that many, you know. Um, the popsicles were a no. No, no, no. Absolutely. If I'm going to pay $4 for a popsicle, uh, I'm going to eat it, just saying. Um, so, for me... The candies were okay, but I would rather have my candy as is. And the ice cream, I'd rather have it in the popsicles as is. So when I'm freeze drying things, most of what I would freeze dry would not be novelty items. I will be freeze drying veggies and meats and eggs and that sort of thing that I need long-term storage. And I would only be doing the ones that I needed for long-term storage. Um, so I guess if it answers a few questions, is ice cream sandwiches good? Yes. They do not rehydrate though. They're, they're not good rehydrated. They would get soggy and it wouldn't be the same, but they are good just as is freeze dried. Um, but no, I will not do it on a regular basis. And so that's my honest opinion of ice cream sandwiches and popsicles. Thank you guys from Deep South Homestead. She's trying to make it. Hey, <laughs> let her know about it. Mama? She's going to take it. Eat it? We want to see. She said no. Wait, what do you think, will. Grace? You want to do a bite? Did this disappear in your mouth? Mm -hmm. Went away? What do you think? Let my try? Yeah. And Christopher try. Do you know what it is? What does it taste like? Let me taste. It don't taste like an ice cream sandwich. Oh, did she drop some? Yeah. She likes it. Is it good? That's good. Does it taste like an ice cream sandwich? Mm -hmm. My turn. What do you think? She's she still munching it. on it? Still Go for it.
I like it. What does it taste like? <laughs> sort of like an Oreo. Oreo. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty much. What do you think? Miss Lippy's pulling the baby. Oh, 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 we got some, didn't we? <laughs> didn't we? Yummy for the tummy. Yummy for the tummy. Pretty good.